All right, we're playing on medium difficulty with uh, Cyborg. Classic battle. Hope you enjoy. Please leave a like, subscribe, comment, you run along now. and enjoy. I have business to attend to. Begin. <laughs> Weapons hot. Don't mess with the best. Classic right here. Fairly good quick battles. Oh, these will be good. If you're wondering if I play online, I do occasionally. Just right now, I'm going through. Offline. Don't mess with the best. 
And yes, if you're wondering, this is the Ultimate Edition. It basically comes with all the DLC. I which is actually a really good deal. Considering I think it's like 50 bucks right now. And it's over like $75 of DLC. Including the game. Both kind of hit each other there. Try some of these. I fail to see the point of this. About to get real up in here. mess with the best. Yeah. Titans versus League. This is good. Although I actually think Cyborg could beat Arrow. But, yeah, that's just what I think. I ran into that. That was my fault. I was probably playing a little too safe. Probably should have just gone after him a little more. Oh well. Probably put in more grabs and stuff. Probably won a little quicker. Now Batman I think could be a sight board. 
He has things up his sleeve all the time. Just because it's Batman. Begin. If you're wondering what costume this is, this is Batman's new 52. Actually, I can't even believe I dashed under that. It's ridiculous. That was Batman's mistake there. Probably could have blocked to counterattack me. I should have gone for an overhead, but it still worked out okay. Oh, this will be tough. They made Batgirl really good in this game, and Grundy's good in this game too. Like if you see a tyrant play, he's really good with Grundy. Of course he's a good player in general, but... Honestly, I think it could be an even match between them if Batgirl doesn't win. Like, that's how close I think it is. Because I think Batgirl has a slight edge because of her teleport. But if uh, Cyborg finds a way to stop that, um, he could win. Now Grundy I think has a chance to against Cyborg, even though Cyborg pumps out a lot of shots and projectiles because he has a lot of armor. And he has a projectile of his own, even though it's a ground one. Begin. I'm pretty sure you got me.
don't mess with the best. There's a problem with that move I'm doing. You can block it, then he's left open. It's quick, it's just if you block it. Cyborg's left open, that's why you have to be careful with that punch. Cyborg does. But it does anti-air, which is very good. So if someone likes to try and jump in, you can just use that move and hit him. Harley's good, it's just her projectiles only go like diagonal and forward. She dashed in Don't too much, so I got her. Like I said, it's very quick. But speaking of which, the next video I want to do is uh, Batman. So let me know what DLC costume you want to use. Because I was speaking about Batman earlier, and, uh, and it's coming to the end of the video here. So just tell me which character costume you want to use see me as do you want to see me as Batman Beyond do you want to see me as the new 52 do you want to see me as default insurgency or just whatever do you I, I'll try and uh show you at the end of this video here what costumes there are so you can get an idea like I'll make a video if you want me to what costumes there are just let me know in the comment or ask and I'll let you know. And actually what's different about Superman in the uh, battles, I don't know if everyone knows this, which they might, is that he's given slightly extra defense and extra attack power. until like when he gets low on the first bar then it's normal except his attack isn't normal might lose this one. Yep.
will have order. It's about to get real up in here. <laughs> After Superman's defeat, Cyborg led the assault on the Fortress of Solitude to flush out remnants of the High Counselor's regime. The fortress was well defended, the battle intense. Cyborg was forced to use unfamiliar Kryptonian tools to make repairs to his damaged cybernetics. Enhanced with the alien technology, Cyborg found he could communicate with Superman's androids and order them to apprehend the opposition. With his army of super androids, Cyborg will bring justice to the world.